about your teammate first, Carl Anthony Towns. A lot of chatter around him. He made the first three points of this game and finished with 33. What does he mean to this team? Uh, we pay him all the money. He's supposed to do that. <laughs> I mean, um, you know, we expect him to do that every night. Obviously, it's just it's just one game. Um, first to win two games now. We're super excited. We know it's going to be a tough environment in Memphis, but we're ready for the challenge. You guys did a great job of defending without fouling. A great job on Morant. What did that take to get that done tonight? Obviously, a team effort. Um, but you got to give a shout out to our crowd, man. They're the reason why we won this game today. They was. We we we've been having leads. We had a we had a 25 point lead last game. We kind of let our fans down. We definitely want to do that shit today. This one's all tied up, two to two. What do we know now about Memphis that can help you on Tuesday night going to Memphis to get that W? Get as much rest as we possibly can. Wolves, thanks, baby gang. Well, Patrick Beverly, I mean, he got into Ja Morant tonight and did a great job defending Ja, who was 4 of 13 from the field. Just 11 points. Beverly added 17 points of his own, including four made threes. And yes, Timberwolves fans, you are guaranteed a game six here in downtown Minneapolis next week. But first, the Timberwolves need to go to Memphis, try to take care of business in game five. They win a game four to not up a series of two for the first time in franchise history. What an answer back game for Carl Anthony Towns. 33 and 14. Marnie and Rebecca with the Wolves live post game edition coming up after this timeout. This is the feeling of 